how y'all doing today, man? Um, welcome to the channel, man. HK Compound. Like, comment, subscribe, man. Join the channel. Um, if you're watching the videos, man, please leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Um, little news today. Um, I don't know. Maybe uh, Ruby. I don't think Ruby took. I don't know. She lost some weight, actually. So I'm like, that's weird. I don't know. She would be four, five, four or five weeks right now. So just gonna keep an eye on her for the next couple of days and see how she do. Um, I'm at work right now. I got to. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's been crazy though. Past couple of days, uh, had some uh, family events, you know, graduations, all that. You know, it's end of the school year. My kids, cousins, and all that stuff graduating and all that other stuff. So, I don't know, I might throw some clips of that in the video. I don't know, so y'all can see. Um, Wisdom and, uh, and Babies Pups are still doing great, strong, uh, going on two weeks. I'm going to get an update on them. I haven't had a chance to uh, go over there like I thought I was going to. I wasn't able to go. It wasn't that I wasn't able to go. It's just all this popped up at the same time, so I just kicked it with the family all weekend, man, and just enjoyed myself. Um, got a little stress off me. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much how the week went. Um, Bonnie's doing great. Like I said, she's putting on more weight, so she looks, you know, she's looking better. Um, her and Wisdom just licking each other all night. Um, like they, two, two lovebirds. I wish I would have caught some of it. I should, I might catch, I might show y'all a clip of that later so y'all can see what they be doing. They just be licking each other's faces all night. Like, <laughs> like they in love for real, for real. But I just want to uh, speak to y'all, man. I know I'm not the biggest YouTuber yet. I'm new to this. Um, still getting a little following. You know, we had 170, 160 something subscribers which is great for me you know I, I want it to be better I want it to be more you know I want to get monetized real quick um, so we can keep bringing more content um, and just giving y'all more and more and more and more updates of everything that's going on and showing y'all a lot more videos and stuff that y'all want to see um, but you know you gotta leave comments you gotta let me know what you think you gotta talk to me let me know I'm, I'm here uh, I reply to everything um, from other videos that I used to post um, stuff that I post now in my shorts like I get a lot of comments in the shorts so I always reply back and I tell people hit me up on the Instagram if you're interested in any pup or if you're interested in anything the best way to contact me is Instagram Instagram is the best way to contact me right now I don't have another number to just give out to people I got enough phone calls every day about other stuff that I got going on for me to have a phone number for people to call to contact me and all that other stuff just best way to contact me is Instagram. That's HK underscore compound. HK underscore C O M P O U N E. HK compound. That's the best way. That's the best way to contact me. If you have any questions, concerns about any dog, any breeding, anything, or if you're just trying to contact me for business purposes or anything like that, that's the best way to contact me. You either you got spam and scammers and all that other stuff. I can I, I know what's real and what's fake. It's really not that hard to notice the difference. Um, yeah, that's the best way to contact me, um, the Instagram, or you can follow my Facebook page. My other Facebook page is HK Compound, all one word. Um, just type it in uh, Facebook search, and it should pop up with a picture of Wisdom, the black and white photo. Um, easy. Easy to that message me on there. Let me know what you want. Um, the litter with Jada and Jesse, those pups are looking amazing. They really are. I don't know if they're gonna get their ears clipped or not like that, but if y'all interested in any of those pups, remember they are inbred. They have no kinks, no flaws, really, no overbites, none of that, no high backs. They are they actually look like great show quality dogs. Um 
They look real good. They got great tone on them. And just remember, they're only seven weeks old. They, well, they should be turning eight uh, in a couple of days, but they are seven weeks old. So they still, they look good. They, they really, they really do. They really do look good. Um, what else? What else I need to tell y'all? I don't know, I think that's pretty much everything I got right now. Uh, it, it ain't a lot of stuff right now. Crazy going on. The summer's gonna start. People playing and stuff. I'm stuck in traffic. So, whatever y'all interested in, man, like I said, hit me up on Instagram, HK underscore compound, or hit me on Facebook, HK compound. Those are the two best ways to get in contact with me. Those are the only ways I'm allowing people to contact with me right now. Um, the litter for um, Jesse and Jada, that litter, I think the pricing would be starting at maybe like 950 non-papers and 2000 with papers. Um, like I said, I'm, we, not, we don't have crazy pets on these pups. We giving you quality dogs. So it's not that you know, they don't have bullseye or they ain't got no good pads in them because they got good pads. Our dogs come from the Midwest and we're down here in the South. So people want to see, you know, Dax, bullseye, you know, some of the great micros, uh, what's it, Mr. Freak, something like that. I don't know, it's a, it's a bunch of bunch of good looking dogs out here, a bunch of good looking micros and, uh, you know, extreme pockets out here. Uh, but I'm telling you that we're giving out great quality dogs as well. You know, the, the bully game is, it's, it's, it's a competitive game, but it's not really competitive to certain breeders. Some breeders, you know, we deal with our own stuff. We have our own things in our yard. We we got bloodlines that people ain't looked at in a long time, you know, like Goochland or, um, you know, some of that Midwest Bully Blood or um, Purple Line or, you know, some of that stuff people haven't been looking at in a long time. Or, you know, like Razor Edge, even though a lot of these dogs are Razor Edge, you know, Remy and all that other stuff, but, you know, they changed the name of them, you know, Dax and all that, but, you know, it's part of the game, bro, you learn as you go, um, yeah, man, I, I, I just love it, bro, I, I just, I don't know, me personally, I don't have anything with any breeders, and I just love, you know, seeing all the different types of dogs, to the Fluffies, to the Mike Rose, to the XLs, to the Double XLs, to even the mastiffs. Um, so yeah, I'm just, I just, I just, I love it. You know, I love the dog, man. I always love, I always love dogs anyway. So that's my thing. Uh, we are located in Georgia. If you was worried, if you were, if you needed to know, we are in Georgia. Uh, willing to ship anywhere in our region or deliver, most likely deliver. Um, I really don't have any trusted shipper right now that I can just, you know, hand a dog out to and be like, hey, take this dog to Vegas. So if you're interested in any of that, like, you know, send me a message. Let me know any trusted shippers that you guys know or any, uh, you know, any trust, any people that you trust in general when it comes to transporting a dog. Um, we got eight pups on the ground, two different litters. We got... Jesse and Jada litter, that inbred litter, and we got another four pups from Wisdom and Baby's litter. And Wisdom and Baby's litter is a champion bloodline. Um, Wisdom is Jada's brother, um, Jesse's son. So he's from that same breeding as Jada. But uh, Baby, she has a great, she has a great pen in her. Um, champion Lucky Luciano. Uh, mother of that breeding is also a champion um, her grandfather is a champion her father I think is mr. Uh, freak mr. I don't know something like that I gotta I gotta go back and look but that pet line is full of nothing but champions nothing but champions um, and it's, it's great that we got to do this breeding with him uh, with my boy Grim, uh, Showtime. If y'all follow him on uh, Instagram, that's Grim Bullies. Um, and like, I really appreciate, you know, him allowing us, uh, you know, bring my stud to her. And um, I, the dogs look beautiful to me, they look great. 
They're only two weeks old. Only two weeks. And they look great. They look like show quality dogs already at two weeks. It's simple. Um, yeah, man, man, I got like, some traffic, y'all. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Uh, yeah, out of that litter, out of that litter, most likely two pups are going to be for sale. Maybe three. I know I'm keeping a girl. I just don't know which girl I'm gonna keep. I, I, but I, I got a preference because one of them, one of the girls look like wisdom. And I really like that about her. And I might keep her. And then there's another girl in that litter as well that I'm interested in. And I'm not sure yet. I'm just gonna wait probably like another week or two and see how they turn out. And then pick from out of the last two two other girls. Or three other oh yeah, two other girls. And my boy Grim, uh, his wife wants the boy, so you know. I, l I let her have the boy. I'm not really tripping off that. I got I got wisdom. Man. She loves wisdom too, so she wanted a boy off the hill. So you know, it's all love and respect. Um, like I said, we 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 building something together, and we gonna continue to build something together. Uh, me and Graham, and also um, Cookie, 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 Cookie. My boy Pre, his dog. Um, she is more on the bulldog side. So she's real short, chubby, um, overbite. And we just wanna, like with that with that breeding, I think that's gonna be a, a fire breeding because with one, we're gonna get color, which I wanted out of the cook, out of the baby uh, litter, but it didn't happen, but still, we still got great dogs. Um, but out of the cookie litter, I'm expecting color. Um, I'm expecting bone. I'm expecting chest. I'm expecting head, uh, good rears. Um, and bringing them up because she's probably about she's probably about six seven inches I mean, at, at the at the most ten I, from you know from her a lot of this, you know I, I can't think of her right now I'm trying to keep from hitting this challenge but she got she's about at the at the, at the max ten inches and she's she she's beautiful it's just the overbite that's it she's a beautiful dog. And I can't wait to do the AI for that. Um, and expecting, she hasn't been bred. She's, I think she's going on two. She hasn't been bred. So if, if this goes well, which I hope it do, which it should do, it should go well. Probably about eight pups out of her. I hope, I hope maybe eight, at the least five. And that's gonna change. I think that would change the game for a lot, a lot, uh, a lot between you know me and Pre and Grim for all three of us. I think I think all three of us could benefit something off of that, uh, bringing something new, something different, something people haven't seen in a while. And that's all I'm trying to, you know, that's all I'm trying to do. I'm trying to bring a great, a great consistent pet and good looking bloodline like i don't me personally i don't care if, if your dog has 15 20 champions back to back you know 40 times this 40 times that you know as long as it's consistent and the the quality of the dog from the great grandparents follows down to the, the their ancestors the ones that are here now you know their great grandchildren and all that like you can still see like you know, you can see the tweaks and the, you know, the fixes and the corrections and the breeding, but that, that, that temperament, the attitude, the love, you know, that's still the same for all the dogs. And that's what I want to see. I want, I want to see that this dog will adapt. This blood will adapt and the blood won't taint and it will, it will be like gold or like diamonds like no matter what happens you know just wipe me off a little bit and i'm gonna shine like that's 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 all i that's that's all i want for my own blood line. that's what i want for my blood line. Like, you look at wisdom 20 years from now and you have a pup from one of his descendants and you're looking at wisdom and you're looking at that descendant and you're like yeah yeah he did that one 
Uh, and, that's, and that's what I want my legacy to be at HK Compounds. I want people to understand that I'm not here to get, I'm not here to just sell dogs and make money, which everybody is into. You know, making money is, is the point of the, you know, point of doing it. Like everybody's trying to make a dollar. But I want people to understand like you spend, you know, $2,000 or $10,000 or 20 or 40 or $50,000 with me that that dog that you bought for me, that dog's, that dog's going to be like everything to you. No matter if it was for 2,000 or if it was 50,000. Like that's, a, that's, that's going to be the dog you're going to love in your yard. That's what I'm trying to create. That's what I want. That's what I want y'all to believe. I want, I don't, well, not what y'all believe. It's what I believe, period. But I want y'all to see my dream come true. I want all of y'all to see that. So, that's the end of today's episode, man. Still in traffic. Happy Memorial Day weekend. Y'all have fun. Be safe out here, man. I love y'all. Be blessed. And uh, thank you. Stop. <laughs> this motherfucker deep.